folks, welcome to my channel, Kern2000. Here, I'm going to have a pickups video. As I'm gonna start off with, um, these are gonna be the things that I found at recent toy shows and also out in the wild that I've been collecting. Um, I'm gonna start off with some of these. Uh, first off, you'll see this nice diorama that I'm gonna start being using in some of these videos that I got for a very good price at one of the shows, which I, I love. I think I'm gonna get another one to put on this side to make it look like a really big garage for everybody. Um, some of the cars that I've been getting uh, loose, I got this, which I love this this car. Like, look at the, the wheels on it, the details on the inside, uh, the front part, I mean, there's uh, the lights are not ac acrylic, but I love the fact that this is not in the card. Um, it's been in one of the multi packs for Hot Wheels. Really, I mean, all of these have been in uh, multi packs. Like this, this DeLorean with this coloring. Like I love this color. Normally, you see the the silver, and I love this color so much. The wheels. Um, it feels really good in the hands and everything. Uh, it, it also really good as it rolls. And another one of my favorites, as I'm gonna leave those two for last, the paintwork. The paintwork on this Dodge, oh my gosh. Actually, no, it's a Camaro, I'm sorry. This, look at this, the badging on the inside looks really nice. The wheels, um, it rolls pretty okay compared to the the DeLorean moves a lot better but I love the paintwork on it uh, I love the casting this is actually one of my favorites that I have out of, out of, out of all of these right here this is a, a beautiful beautiful car and then of course we got the exotics if um, I don't drop them this one uh, I thought the doors open oh I'm wrong the door doesn't open Okay, but uh, both of these, beautiful. The, you can see, the if I can put it more on the center, I'm so sorry. Just, I love everything about these. They're so, so good. But yeah, these are the loose models that I've been getting. Really, really love these. Um, also got recently, which I'm gonna start been using in some of these. I've got one of these. I'm official, guys. I have a turnst uh, turnstile that I can start using on some of the cars that uh, I get, so I can do close-ups and everything. Uh, you know, your boys, your boys, adding a couple of things to the channel. So I'm real excited about these. Um, make sure I don't drop this. So. Sorry about the roughness of this video so far, but you know, it's my first time doing a pickups video. Well, no, not the first time, but ju just like doing it in this style. One of the other ones that uh, I don't think I've really shown on camera. Very happy to get this in my collection. This Forerunner. At I've got the other one where it was all black, and I think that's the only. I think Hot Wheels have only done two castings of the Forerunner. Uh, I think the others are all going to be in Matchbox. But this was the very first one before they did the special edition. It's got the real riders on it. I The card looks beautiful on it. Um, not really interested in getting most of everything in this set. Uh, maybe the Civic uh, and the Mercedes Benz. But well, that Nissan hard body looks nice. But I really wanted this, got this for, I think, $25. More than I usually spend on a Hot Wheel, but I really wanted to have this in my collection. Uh, next, yeah, we'll just put that guy back here. Next, we picked up this. Uh, I saw this and I had to have it. Uh, this Lamborghini, oh my goodness. This Huracan is, oof, folks. I love the detail, the wing on it. The wheels look nice. The, oh, I'm messing up my cars back here. And I, this was from 90, no, from 2016. I, 
I haven't seen this casting since. Really? Uh, like I told you, I'm new to this. This, one of my favorite pickups I've had. And to keep on the Lamborghini uh, train that we got going on, this Countach, this Lamborghini Countach that I found, I love the way this looks. Um, from Matchbox, it says it's the super fast. I, I think I'm gonna open this sucker. Like, uh, I'm open most of the ones that I get, and some of them I keep when I have duplicates. But this Matchbox, whew. sometimes Matchbox they they hit it out the park. Like I said, to go on with the Lamborghini, I also got this Lamborghini as well. This Countach, I love the coloring on it. Like, it doesn't have the wing, which is what I really like about these two over here. But it's, I mean, you grow up, you, you as a kid, you have these cars on your on your wall. Uh, I don't know about nowadays if anybody has cars. Maybe it'd be the Pagani or maybe a Bugatti or whatever. But I had loved the Countach. Um, still looking for an actual red Countach that I had from 1990. Uh, still looking for that. But, you know, we'll get it. We'll get it, guys. Now we're going to keep on the old school train. I got this Ferrari. Dude, look at this. Look at this. And I can feel the weight of it compared to some of the ones now. This, This is... This is diecast when diecast was wow. It I can't even say enough about this. This is beautiful. The card is beautiful. Uh, really, really happy to have this in here. I think this is like a 1996, but really good casting for this car. And then I also found this. Yes, look at this Porsche, guys. Look at the paint on this like it's kind of a matte but I love the stripes as well and the wheels I really like the underbody uh this this one like I I I love it uh, this I love this outlaw version of, of this Porsche man this this sucker is whew. and to keep going I got this moving parts Mitsubishi Lancer I I grew up watching Initial D, and this Lancer was one of the ones where it was one of the hardest ones that Takumi had to had to race against. I mean, you can see the the inside where you can see the engine. If I uh, don't blind it with the light on here, but I I love the detail on this the, man. The uh, I watching that show, I wanted a Lancer, and you know. They don't make it anymore, and that that's the lantern that I, I really like. Oh, almost dropped you. And here we go. This this Toyota man. I can't say enough of this Toyota. It's it's beautiful. You know I already like the two, uh, 2000 GT. I have the, the premium version of it. And of course, I had to get this version when I saw it. I saw my boy get it, so I had to get it as well. I got it, and I also got the other color variant. As you can tell, look at this card. So you know what your boy's gonna do? Exactly. We opened this sucker up. So we got a close up of the 2000 GT. Ooh, look at this man you can see the karate on the side from the Tokyo Olympics I wish I could see the taillights that they were uh, acrylic but all in all man I love this rolls really nice man this rolls real nice we're gonna put this right in the garage with everyone else here I'll take these guys out of here give you some give them some room Put white right there. There we go. To keep going on, I know if you've seen the recent video of mine, you saw I had to pick up this Mazda RX-7. It had the original color that it came out with. This, this RX-7 is beautiful. It's a new casting. 
uh, for Johnny Lightning, and I think they did it out, man. They did it out. They they really knocked it out the park. Uh, and also, Johnny Lightning Lightning has the yes. This is the monsters, uh, like Dragula. The, um, uh, what is it? Uh, Uncle Festers, I think. Is it? It's his uh, coffin car, as they call it. Um, bro, I'm all about this. I, I have, I have also this guy right here and stuff so i was very happy to to pick this up at one of the at one of the shows really happy and then to go along with the the rest of the 007s i've been getting i love this fear <laughs> this the lotus i called it a fiero uh, please don't take my car license from me see seriously this Lotus, I mean, when I think of 007, I think of the Lotus. I, I just do. Uh, I have a, the other Lotus around here somewhere, but this one, whew, man, uh, I, I dig this one so much. And then uh, to go along with the, uh, with the movie cars, I also have this Ghostbusters Ecto-1. This is from uh, part two of the movie. Uh, actually, no, this is Ecto-1, but... Uh, it's not the part two one. It, it's it's the original, and I man, if you grew up with this movie, you grew up with you know you love it. it. It feels nice. It's really good. I I love how this looks. I'm still looking for the Back to the Future uh, Ford truck, or not Ford truck. I think it's a Toyota truck. I'm still looking for that truck. I can't find it, but I'm still looking for it. And then finally, to keep with Back to the Future, yes. To go along with my Back to the Future 3, I've got the part one. Uh, still, and, and also they released the, uh, what is it, Biff's car when uh, all the, the manure uh, <laughs> fell on it. So I'm looking for that as well. But this, I, I dig this, so. But yeah, that's, um, that's some of the... The pickups that I've had recently, uh, I have a few a few main lines that I picked up, uh, and in some stuff you know you have, you know I've gotten this ultra hot Volkswagen along with the other ultra hot, and then I've also got a few of the 55th anniversary. I've got the Land Rover which. I love this Land Rover so much. I love the paintwork on it and the wheels. Uh, almost looks like real riders, but they're not. And then also I have the Nissan. The 180SX. And then finally, to uh, finish off this video, a couple, of, uh, a couple more uh, mainline Hot Wheels that I got. I got this Lotus. I got this Lotus because look at this paintwork on here, dude look at it and look at the card like this this thing's beautiful uh i i dig this one so much and the wing because i don't see the wing on there very much and i got the honda civic custom pretty sought after uh for the jdm crowd and i i love the badging on it looks like stickers uh you got the back window where it's all the racing and everything for for the rally sport and then finally that's the martin vantage with the wing and the coloring i like the color the most on here i really do i like the color so yeah those are the pickups that i've gotten um uh, of course my favorites i'm just gonna put them all right here some of my some of my favorites that i got There we go. Of course, this one. Man, look at this. All right, then. A uh, little bit longer video than normal, but uh, I was pretty backed up on some of my pickups that I've gotten. Uh, you'll see more. Uh, I have a few more of these that I'm going to be putting out. Uh, some other pickups and everything. But, yeah, these are... The, the, man, I can't say enough. Uh, finding some of these uh, Ferraris, Hot Wheels, and uh, Matchbox and everything. Uh, thanks for rocking with me. Uh, thanks for listening uh, to me just babble on about cars and my nonsense. And hope to see y'all.
y'all more. Thanks.